There, oh boy, that's a big Whoa. fish. Big fish. Welcome to Fishing with Latin with Latin Langman and co-host Steve Ronholt. You can buy that expensive tackle that you think that you might need. You can head out for the river and hope you might succeed. But if you want to fish just right, just turn your TV on. Come on, fish with Latin, he'll get your fishing on. Yeah, come on, fish with Latin, and you'll have some fun. Catch some fly in Alaska on the wild Yukon, or catch some trout and salmon in good old Washington. Fishing with Latin, casting with Latin, man, that's a lot of fun. Fishing with Latin, casting with Latin, man, that's a lot of fun. Ladies and gentlemen, we have a beautiful day here on Sprague Lake in Washington. We know there's some fantastic rainbows in here. Stick around. I think it'll be a great show. There we go. Got that one. Oh, he spit the hook. <laughs> yeah, that was cool. Oh, man. Ah, darn Big it. Big jump and he spit the hook. Yeah. There we go. Nice. Good job, Steve. Thanks. Feels like a decent fish. Looks like it too. Wow. Got some weight to him. Yeah, it's just fighting straight down. Yeah. It's awesome. Yeah, no <laughs> kidding. Steve is keeping steady pressure on the fish. Whoa! Nice. I can see him flashing. Wow. Big guy. Looks good. I don't know what he is, but it's, it's not fighting like the rainbows as much, you know, jumping and stuff. So maybe it's something else. Wow. Whatever it is, it's big. Yeah, he feels pretty good size. He's just digging down. Steve arranged the net and continued to fight the weighty fish. Using uh, that's a rainbow, it's a nice rainbow. Wow. Using 4X tippet, so it should be okay, you know. It's a pretty good sized fish. Here he comes. Oh boy. Big. That's a nice rainbow, yeah. Really nice. Oh yeah. Woo! It's a good slap. Woo! And here he goes again. Keep him away from your anchor rope. I'm trying. He doesn't. He keeps wanting to go that way. Man, I want to get this guy in. Yes. Oh my gosh! Yeah. Huge. <laughs> Woohoo! That's a hog. Huge. That is a hog. Holy moly. Wow. What a nice fish. We heard about some big fish, fat fish, in Sprague Lake here in Washington. Sure enough, the first one we land is just an absolutely fat fish. You got to see this, folks. It's just amazing. Look at the size of that thing. Probably 18, but what's amazing about it is just its depth. Incredible fish. Get my net. And there he goes. We also fished Bragg on a cloudy, cold day where I hooked this nice fish. Yeah. All right. Cool. Finally got a takedown. Been fishing these chronomids for a while. Seems like a pretty good fish. 
That's pretty exciting. Wow, that looks like a good fish, lad. Whoa, he's just going, going to town. He's coming at me right now. He's trying everything to get, get away. Man, when I hooked that fish, took my indicator down, took off like a dang rocket. I mean, it pulled out line, about made three strong runs, came right at me. Then it dove down toward the weeds. It was trying everything possible to get off. Yeah, it's just dogging down. That's usually a sign of a big one, huh? Oh, it's a beauty. It's one of the big, big guys. Come on. Yeah, it's big. Oh boy, I got caught on that dropper. Oh, please. Oh boy, got it in. Wow, what a monstrous hog. <laughs> oh, what a fight. And folks, that was a fantastic fight, fought super hard. And this is why you use barbless hooks right here. <laughs> when I released the fish, the fish rolled, the fly got caught right on my fingertip. And it hurt, I'm not gonna lie, it hurt. This fly is actually embedded in my finger. Even with the barbless hook, it's gonna hurt. Ah, oh, oh well. Try it. Sure. Ah ha! Got it. Good thing you're using barbless hooks. Be sure to join us next time for more fishing with Lad. Because we're having fun catching fish. <laughs>